Good morning, gardening friends. It's Tuesday. I'm later than last week, so let's get to the update. Okay, we're unscripted here, and uh, I think this one's going to be pretty short because I haven't really thought through, but not a whole lot has changed. Uh, the main point would be that uh, most of the plants are still alive, despite some real heat this past week. Um, I have tried to make sure I stayed on top of watering, but there are a couple of little differences. Let's take a look. Okay, starting at the far end, we've got the purple orchid tree. I planted three seeds and it looks like, yeah, I did kind of move off to the side to check. It looks like there's only two of them actually growing, but two out of three ain't bad, right? Meatloaf. The first of the uh, yellow wax beans it seems to be doing okay. It hasn't changed a whole lot. If you look towards the bottom though, and maybe I can throw in a, a little picture in picture here or side by side so you can see. Uh, it looks like it's healthier at the bottom than it is at the top, which would indicate that it was struggling at the top and it's putting out new leaves to try and grow again. The uh, older orchid tree, it's a little hard to give you a full view of this, partly because I was zoomed in, but it's not much taller than it was before and unfortunately the lighting is just kind of messed up enough that it's not easy to show you, but it's healthy and it continues to survive. It may not be a lot taller, but it's still alive. The first of the nasturtiums is still doing okay. Uh, the newer plants have, have grown up nicely, but now they're starting to kind of fall over. We've had a, a fair amount of wind. In fact, there's a good gust going right now, uh, but they're looking okay. The Roma tomatoes are doing good in the red pot there, and in a green pot we've got the transplanted wax bean which survived the transplant. Uh, it looks like the leaves at the very, very bottom, which were probably the initial leaves that came out, those, are, those have died off, but uh, the leaves at the top have gotten maybe a little bit bigger than they were last week. So I'm happy to see that these are still alive. Now, in this case, uh, we've got the other nasturtium, and it is kind of fallen over. That's all three of them have grown. Um, they're still alive, and it is really kind of a trailing plant more than an upright, so this is kind of, that, I guess, that stage where it made the transition in the past week. And finally, we have the bottle planters. Uh, the tomatoes in those bottle planters have not gotten a whole lot bigger. They've kind of stalled out, but they're still alive. I checked, uh, I actually meant to check last weekend when I recorded the last episode to make sure there was water in them. There's still water in them now. I forgot back then, but uh, everything seems to be okay. They're just not growing as fast as I thought they would. Uh, I don't know if that means anything. We've had some heat, we've had some wind, but the wind shouldn't affect them because they're inside. Uh, but that's pretty much it. That's how things are looking in the garden. This is the Budget Gardener signing off, saying may your thumb be green.